Day 104 of the 100 pound, 365 day body transformation is here. I've been feeling like my weight has been plateauing a little bit and I feel like I'm behind on my goals for the week. Let's see what happens today, let's go. Welcome everybody to day 104. I'm so thankful you're here, I'm thankful to be here. If you're anything like me, the diet always starts tomorrow. Well, it's tomorrow somewhere. And this is the channel where we're taking you on a daily to show you exactly what we're doing to lose 100 pounds in 365 days. Make sure to like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. It's free. Like, for sure. Okay. <laughs> Time for wait for the day. You guys, I have been like freaking out a little bit because we're on day 14 of our 30 day current challenge. We still haven't hit our challenge yet. And I'm like, oh my gosh. And you've seen like the weight is weird. It, it'll go down and then it'll plateau and then it'll go down again. And instead of just going down a little bit each day. So I'm kind of getting used to that. But today I went and got on that scale and I could not believe it. I lost 1.1 pounds. We were down to 234.9 pounds. That's a total of 53.6 pounds off so far. And I was like, wow, wow, wow. I couldn't believe it. So I was so stoked. That brings us now, we're on day 14 of our current 30 day challenge. Our starting goal on the 30 day challenge was 5.62 pounds today we are at 4.7 pounds lost so far in the challenge on day 14 of the 5.62 so we're doing good i'm excited about that we've got 0.92 pounds left to hit our goal and i can't wait to do it because i really want to raise our goal and I wanna set new goals, because I wanna hit double digits, man. I, I really want to, so we'll see how it goes. On the fasting front, smacked it out of the park, no problem. It was two hours I ate yesterday. I got done pretty early, I think like 1.30 or something. It was awesome. The keto makes it so easy. I still am hungry, and I'm gonna share with you what I've been doing on tomorrow's recap day. I've been really hungry, and the thing that's crazy is I've been even hungry in the morning. And so I've been feeling some heart palpitations, and it's because I've been drinking so much coffee in the morning, so I'd reduce that. And so I think that might have something to do with my hunger in the morning. On a scale from one to 10, when I was on sugar and carbs, my cravings and hunger felt like a 4,000, and now they feel like a two that I can deal with, no problem, squash them, I got no issue with that. And so the intermittent fasting allows me to totally reduce calories and feel super full once a day, which is just awesome. So that's what's happening. It's totally going good and I'm stoked. Training time, we're on track for our 5K, I think. Everything's going good. We're gonna get that baby and we're gonna do it in the time frame that we had set out all those days ago when we set our goals. And I'm just stoked that we did a good goal that is realistic and it is far enough out that it took into account the issues that would come up between now and then. So we're killing it, doing a good job on that. The challenges this week were to do the six one-third mile walks, and I've been doing those. The new puppy has really helped out with that because I get to take him out all the time to try and potty train him at the same time. So that's been really good. I just feel great. Those shorter walks have not affected my hip at all. So it's totally going good, and I'm psyched about it. Training Tuesday went awesome. That mile and a half was totally doable. I was feeling a little tight in my hip at the end of it, but it was totally good. I mean, awesome, awesome, awesome. And I'm just so stoked to be back out doing that. I'm so excited. And this next week, we'll have a new goal for the Challenge Tuesday, which will be good. Like, subscribe. Subscribe below. Like, totally. It's free. If you haven't yet, Take a look at these before and after pictures. And <laughs> the, day, the first one you see there is my day one. The second one is this morning. You guys, I can see such a massive difference just on a daily, not even looking at those, just when I look in the mirror, or my kids take a picture, or my wife takes a video of me with the kids or something. And I'm like, oh my gosh, it's so awesome what a change it's been. But you let me know in the comments if you see a change. And if you do, let me know what you see. And if you don't see any at all and you think I'm crazy, let me know and maybe I need a reality check. You guys, it was so good to see you today. Look forward to seeing you tomorrow. We have this great video for you. Check that out right now because I think you'll get a lot out of it.